Robert Shorty Rankin was assigned as a replacement pilot to the 56th Fighter Group, the famous Zemke's Wolfpack. On May 12, 1944, Rankin would fly a mission that would put him in an elite category of fighter pilots. What we did, we flew two squadrons type formation into Frankfurt, and we had another one circling over the top of top cover, and we got to Frankfurt, and we did what we call a Zemke fan. We were told to fly a heading, whatever it was, for 15 minutes, and then do the reciprocal and come back. The Zemke fan was devised by Colonel Hub Zemke, the commander of the 56th. It called for fighters to rendezvous ahead of the bomber formations and then scatter by fanning out in arcs. This tactic proved successful on its first run, giving Rankin his first four kills of the day. On the next dogfight, however, both of Zemke's wingmen were shot down and an enemy plane moved in from behind. And about that time I look over, here's a 109 climbing right up on Zemke's under his butt. Fortunately for him, I had just enough ammo left, and I got a few bursts around the cockpit, and that in the ring root area, and the guy slid off like this and popped out of it. That was my fifth one that day. For his actions that day, Shorty Rankin was awarded the Army's second highest award, the Distinguished Service Cross. He became the first P-47 pilot in the European theater of operations to achieve ace in a day, which in turn earned him a total of 10 enemy kills to his credit and the title of double ace.